Reuner has said this week that he is aiming to be back playing for the Manchester derby in November. Can you give us an update on his injury, how he's coming back, and whether that is a realistic return? Uh, I don't know. Really, I don't know. I spoke with, uh, with, uh, with the doctor sometimes, and he's telling me he's going so well, going good, but going well, but I don't know. He has to come back to a training session, see how how it works and we'll see. The important is when he come back on the pitch he's completely fit and can finish the rest of the season. Pep Mandy Henry from Premier League News. Is there any update on Benjamin Mendy's fitness? Injured. And Cardiff are a, a very physical side and they're still looking for their first win. Does that make this a, a difficult and dangerous game for City? Premier is physicality, not just Cardiff, you know I realized immediately when I arrived, well, or immediately when I was outside, they came back here for international games. Always I realized how how physical, you know, is the Premier League and Cardiff, his own way to play, and you have to adapt. So the risk is always home away. Pep Don McGuinness, Talk Sport. You, you mentioned Mendy then injured. What What is the exact problem, and, and how long do you feel that he'll be missing? Well, I don't know. He has a little bit problem in his bone. And um, I don't know. Where about? Is it an ankle? Yeah, the feet. And just about Sergio. Sergio, when he leaves now, it will be ten years. A player like him, uh, of his ability, of his standing in the game, is that going to happen again? Do you feel players staying for ten years when they're not from this country, moving in, is that going to be a unique thing? Yeah, today before it was more more easy to to find. To find players to stay, stay all, all career uh, in the same club, but today even I think is even for the players itself have the curiosity, you know, to live a new experience. So it's not bad when one player try to discover new languages or go with their families in other places or play in other leagues and prove themselves. So it's not bad. So the society is nice for that. We can learn from the other cultures to be a better person. But uh, it happened with Serge, he was Argentina, go to Madrid and now come here. So it's nice. So uh, it's, it's important, you know, it's, a, it's an important player for the club, not just for the team, for the club, what that it means. And, and finish, I don't know, his career, because I don't know it's going to happen when after two, three years, but it's nice to, to count on him. Pep, Simon Stone from the BBC. Just going back to Wednesday, can you explain why the team started so slow, slowly and, and why they made so many mistakes in such a big game? Well, I think with, I, I reviewed the game. We didn't play bad. Was not, I think it was not the best performance, but we didn't know play bad. And, but yes, in the first half, was everything a little bit slow. So they didn't create too many chances. Except the second half, we were better. They had more clear chances. We were exposed more. In front, is that competition that people? I, I, I insist many, many times. It's a completely different competition from the Premier League. Is is uh, they ask a lot of opponents from us. It's so demanding. The quality of them, the physicality. The physicality is not just in the Premier League. In France, in France too, and the quality of, of the opponents. So it's so it's so hard in terms of of, of the level of the teams, and uh, still we have to learn. You know, to to try to to play that game. I have to help the team better than I did in the past. To 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 try to find a way to no more stable because we were we make a, an exceptional. I think first group of stage two seasons ago. The last season was amazing. Of course, we we lost again Basel here, but in, in Shakhtar we were already qualifying first of the of the stage group, and we make a lot of changes in the in the teams and. Um, and, and but you have to find I have to find the, the way to to be more solid. If not, we, we cannot go through. So that that teams are are so good. It doesn't matter who you play. So I saw the game Hoffenheim, Shakhtar, and both teams are are, are so so good teams. And and that's why you have to prepare as well to go through. You've had more players go deep into the World Cup than any other any other club. Are you? Paying for that Manchester City a little bit, uh, is there a bit of tiredness? Is no. there some something? No, I don't believe in the, in the physical condition. I don't believe in that. So physical condition for himself don't exist from my point of view. So 
the mind is control everything. The, what do you have to do on the pitch when you have the ball, when you don't have the ball? How you defend the set pieces? And many, many circumstances is not about the physical. So they are young. They train every day. We take care of them. Very is impossible in terms of the physios, the, the older departments that we have. Uh, for, Absolutely everything for them, so I don't believe in that. So why the first half was slow and the second half we were uh, so quick and were so aggressive, you know? It could be the opposite. So when you are tired, it's always mental approach. And 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 it was a little bit, you know, it was a problem to a start. We, we missed some balls in, 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 in different positions. We didn't defend quite well, we make mistakes and when we are right there we are lucky in the post and hypothetical penalty and in our circumstances in the cut of game the no games that decisions count a lot. It's not a Premier League that you have another game, another game, another game. Here every game is like a final. It's a final, really is a final because this is a short group of stage where one or two mistakes you are out. And the knockout games last like sixteen, eighteen so it's the same. But uh, still, we have chance. Of course, we have five games still, and and we are going to prepare when turn go to Germany to make a good game. Any more for the embargo? Andy. Hi, Pep. Andy Hudson from the Press Association. Um, last season, you did very well in the Premier League games that you played immediately after European games. But, but can it be difficult? Uh, you're going back into the Premier League straight after playing in the Champions League? Yeah, always difficult. So last season we did almost everything well. So I said many times we we cannot forget what we have done, but it's done. And and of course, but that's happened. <laughs> the two teams, you have to know to handle that. Most of the players go to the World Cup. Most of the players go to international breaks. You play every three games. That is what it is. If you want to stay... Be a, uh, like a manager or, or uh, as a manager and, and football player, you have to accept it.